One of the first things we're going to do in this course is to build a server image using this tool called Packer. Packer allows us to spin up a server, install whatever we need to into it, configure it however we need it, and then save that as an image that we can use later. This image is going to be used to spin up servers within AWS quickly and easily using automated systems like auto scaling groups. So why are we starting with Packer on a site in a course about AWS? Well, first and foremost, the courses and articles on Cloudcast is not going to be centered around how to do servers. Instead, it's going to be how to do AWS, which of course means spinning up servers and uh, using automation to get an application up and running in a way that is scalable. One of the basic parts of this is to have a server that is ready to run your application. Now, I don't know what needs to be on your server specifically. You might have applications that use Ruby or Python or Golang or Node or PHP or any of that stuff. That's not going to be what these courses are about, although we might touch on some of those topics um, because there are some things that are language specific, although there's very few. So what we're going to do is start with Packer here, and we're going to build a server image. And we'll use the server image that we make in this course about Packer in later courses as a base image. So the first thing I want to do is install Packer on our machine. So if I head over to the install Packer docs, I'm using Mac OS, and we can see that we can simply use brew to install Packer. So brew tap, HashiCorp tap, brew install, HashiCorp tap, Packer. And then later if we need to upgrade it, we can do brew upgrade, HashiCorp tap, Packer. So I actually have all those steps already done, but I am going to try the brew upgrade step to see if I uh, need to update it. And it's already installed and at a current version, so that's good. So the next few videos, we're going to get started using Packer. We'll see how to set the configuration for Packer, and then of course how to build an image with it. 